crispy. Hey, what's good, viewer? This is Spanky. Today I've got the Marvel Legends Infinite Series Thundra. I don't know anything about her, to tell you the truth. She looks like she's a part of the Wrecking Crew, just because she's got that ball there. But I think she's actually a good person, or a good guy, I guess. Uh, I don't think it says anything about her right here. It says something about the Dragon Chain, Heavy Steel Chain. I don't know. It doesn't really say much about Thundra there. I think that's actually more about Valkyrie than her. Here's the rest of the wave that comes with it. I will definitely be reviewing all of these. They should be completed by the time you see this video. I'm not sure how which order I'm going to put it in. Anyways, check out the rest of my reviews. Stay tuned. I'd really appreciate it. Let's open it up. See a little bit of what Thundra's got going on here. She's got a really nice face sculpt on her. I like that a lot. The way her mouth is kind of like, Ugh, she's grimacing, whatever. Uh, her hair came out really looking good. They've got the darker shades of orange with the lighter shades of orange. Uh, it looks really, really nice. And she's got that little... I guess crown, not really a crown, but you know what I'm talking about, the little headpiece there. Her eyes came out looking pretty good, not too bad there. Uh, we get some pretty basic female body molds going on. Again, it doesn't look like she has much of ab crunch, we'll get in that to later. But it doesn't look bad. Uh, it came out a little bit better than some of the other figures. Most of the other figures don't have this much flesh tone on them. Her gauntlets came out pretty good. Mostly paint apps look pretty good as well. Uh, I like the this right here, it looks like she's kind of got a... Just the way her dress here, I'm not sure, like a metal, just the way it looks. <laughs> I just like the way it looks. It came out looking really good, clean and stuff. The rectangles in there. Um, then we see the lightning bolts on her legs. Those came out pretty clean. And then her feet, they got to two-toned right there. There's a better look at the lightning bolts. I mean, as you can see, the paint apps came out pretty good. It looks like a molded red right there. And then we got molded, for the most part, skin tone. I think that's what it is. I can't be too sure. It looks like it's molded skin tone over red, but that's not too important. Her uh, belt does move up and down. And let's zoom out and look at her chain that she holds pretty well. No complaints about that. I like the way that looks. It's got some darker shades of silver with some lighter shades to kind of give it some depth and some tone to it. And, uh, really shows the detail. I like that a lot. To be really nitpicky, it's all one solid piece, so there should be holes in between those chains, you know, like most chains are just links, but it's all just one solid, uh, if you, if you could, I pointed out, I saw it, but it's not a huge thing, but if you see what I mean, you know, there should be holes in there, because it's a, it's a chain and the way they're linked together, but I guess they didn't have the, uh, molding capabilities to do that, and, uh, my other complaint, which I complained about the Valkyrie figure, is that both hands here are both open fisted hands, as you can see, and I would like one to be a closed fist so she can be punching with the other because she doesn't need two open hands. She only has one uh, weapon, so it would have been nice if they gave her a fist instead of another open hand. Articulation, we're not going to get much of anything out of her head. It won't even do an extra sister or anything to go down at all. Her hair is just uh, blocking it way too much. Shoulders will do the 360. They'll go up that high. She's got an upper bicep swivel, a single jointed elbow. Not too much range of motion out of that. And then a wrist hinge and a swivel. Uh, ab crunch, typical female body mold, just not much going on there. It's more of a diaphragm joint than an ab crunch at all. I didn't see this earlier, but her uh, abs are sculpted really well. They look pretty cool. No belly button, though. Uh, no waist swivel at all. This moves on the Valkyrie figure. is actually molded to the character. It was a different belt, but the belt was molded to the character. Uh, she's got upper thigh swivel here her legs will go up that much for some reason lately I've been having trouble with these female fear characters to have them kick out that's weird I've been having to move it like an old joint these joints are a little bit different for some reason I'm not sure see I had to move it right there to make it go out lately like on the Doctor Strange figure I don't think you have to do that I think yeah this one will just kick out so they got some kinda different mold they got some kinda different hip joint going on here I believe than on the other figures, so that's kind of weird. Double jointed knees. No calf swivel. I think I already covered the upper biceps, upper thigh swivel. And then the ankles. They go down that much, come up that much, and then we get the rocker. So overall, I really do like this figure a lot. It came out pretty good. Not my favorite female figure, but the sculpt is definitely great, and I, I do appreciate the work that went into it. I'm almost positive there's not another Thundra figure out there, so she's one of a kind, so 
go and get her if you like her because you're not going to find her anywhere else and I doubt any other company like Figure, Figma will ever make her so you know get them while you can she was made really well so there's no reason why you should pass on it if you're a fan of the character or you need her to complete a set if you want to complete the rest of the Hulkbuster set check out Big Bad's toy store in the description below uh, other than that, that's all I got for today. I do appreciate you watching my review. Like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned for the other Build-A-Figure uh, Hulk Wave reviews because I got them all coming out here. Uh, have a good day. Peace out.